loves. All right, so today I'm going to be doing a lipstick declutter. And as you can see, this is just going to be a mess. I uh, This is the one I wanted to do the least. That along with my eyeliners. Uh, and probably my makeup brushes, actually. Uh, because I just feel like it's going to be a headache. Um, yeah. But I know there's definitely a lot of things that I want to declutter that I don't use. And there's just no reason for me to actually have them. If I'm not using them, why not give them to someone else so that they can be loved, you know? <laughs> so let me go ahead and jump right into it. I'm going to organize them and then we'll just jump right into it. Organize, I meant just lay them all out on the table and not organize them. So the first thing I want to say is I'm just going to put my chapsticks to the side back in the container because I know I'm not decluttering those. I don't know why I even took them out. But yeah, so I know I'm not decluttering those. I'm just going to like organize them back where they go real quick. Most of these chapsticks are brand new and haven't been used. I keep the ones that I've used in my purse. Or, um, I also have one that's in my everyday makeup drawer. Other than that, these are brand new and haven't been used yet. And then when I lose one <laughs> or finish one, which I don't think I've ever, like, finished a friggin' chapstick, I always just lose them. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, let me go ahead and just see what jumps out at me here. I'm gonna go ahead and start with these Too Faced, uh, Melted Lipsticks. Because I don't think I'm gonna be keeping one of them. So this one I'm definitely keeping. It's like one of my favorite shades. Uh, I do have a pretty good preference on like what shades I like to wear and they're usually pretty neutral or like nude for my skin tone, you know? Um, so there's that one. I feel like this one is a little bit too pinky on me and I don't really wear it because of that reason. This is chocolate milkshake. I'm going to go ahead and declutter this. So I'm going to put this to the side and at the end of the video I'll bring back, I'll show like, you know, the difference between what I declutter and what I kept. Uh, so that's going to go in the declutter pile. This one I'm definitely getting rid of. This is definitely too pink. I don't like how this looks on me. I don't know why I kept kidding myself as if I was going to wear it. And it's funny because it's, is it the same shade? Oh no. It's close to the same shade as that chocolate milkshake, and it's in the shade Nude. It's the Melted Lipstick. I'll go ahead and declutter that as well. So then, um, the next one I'm going to go with is, it's called Get It, and I believe this is the one that we got from, or if you chose it, uh, that is from the Sephora uh, birthday gift this year, and I'm going to go ahead and get rid of it. I don't think I've ever used it. And my birthday's in January, and I got it, you know, in January. So, we get rid of it. Oh, yeah, that means that I almost get to get a new Sephora gift, which I really liked the blush. <laughs> so, um, yeah, here it is. And I'm going to declutter that. And then the next one I know I'm going to declutter is this one by Kat Von D. It's a beautiful shade, but I just know I'm not going to wear it. Like, I haven't. I think I've worn it once or twice, and I took it off pretty soon after. It's called Vampira or Vampira. Um, I just, I don't do well with these dark shades. They get everywhere. Um, oh, that's a lip balm. Jack Black. I'm going to put that back. And then these are the Urban Decay Basquiat collection ones. And although I don't wear these very often, I just, the packaging got me. And I'm just being honest. Like, I'm not getting rid of it because of the packaging mainly. Uh, they are shades that I do wear though. So it's easier for me to be able to say that I have used them. And I plan on using them again. It's a very buttery for, uh, formula and I enjoy it. So go ahead and put that back in its home. Uh, this is the Tarte uh, what is it? Front row. And definitely going to be keeping this. One of my favorite shades. It's just a very beautiful shade. Going to be keeping that. Um, I'm going to go ahead and wipe off my hand real quick. So that way I can keep swatching these lipsticks. Um, okay, so the next one I'm going to look at is this liquid lipstick by MAC. And it's just like a nice nudie color with a gray tone, cool tone, brown, tan, um, and it's called Dash O Spice. I'm going to go ahead and keep that. Um, huh. 
So I do see two shades that look pretty similar here. I'm going to see if I have any more liquid lipsticks that look similar. Um, yeah. So I'm going to go ahead and swatch both of these and see how I feel about them. So I'll start with the Ofra one. Swatch that, baby. And then, yeah. Swatch this, baby. Oh, that's kind of dried out, actually. So that's going. Um, I think both of them are going. Yeah, both of them are going. So this is Ofra. It doesn't say what shade it is. This is Ofra. It's going to be decluttered. Um, and then this is TBT, which is my favorite shade uh, that Tarte offers. Oh, it just needed to be mixed. Okay, actually, it's fine. Uh, it just needed to be mixed. It's like a very moussey lip paint type of formula, so it needed to be mixed. I hadn't used it in a while, uh, but the consistency is good now, so I'm going to keep it. Um, this is my Bunny Lip Paint by Tarte. And it's like a cool tone, pinky gray type of shade. It's called Texas Toast. And it was by uh, Bunny Graveyard Girl. And um, I'm going to go ahead and keep this. And mainly just because it was by Graveyard Girl. Uh, which is not a good reason. I know. But I'm going to. I'm just being honest. Uh, so Namaste is the next shade that I'm going to be taking a look at. And... I think I'm yeah I'm gonna be getting rid of that I, who am I kidding I'm not gonna be wearing that shade of pink um, I probably will give it to my sister she really likes those kind of pinks uh, the next one I uh, actually I'll leave this for a minute um, so I'm gonna go through my Mac lipsticks I know I'm keeping I'm pretty positive I'm keeping all of them so this is my favorite shade right here it's like a very nudie neutral shade for myself um, the next one is the oh I forgot to say what shade that is that is matte naturally transformed uh, and then this one is twig and I really enjoyed this one as well um, and then the next one is mocha really like this one I like all my Mac ones and then the next one is what is that? Taupe. There it is right there. And the next one is Yash. And that's that top one right here. And then the next one is a Velvet Teddy. And I believe this is the most popular uh, MAC lipstick shade and it's that one right there and now you'll see why ah! what dropped it my bad uh so now you'll see why i wanted to wait on this one so this one is by tart i got this in a kit with a highlighter and blush and i believe a sex kit and eyeliner i don't remember what the third thing was but there's three things anyways uh i love this it has your lip liner on this side and then um, it's your lipstick on the other side. And I really love it. Uh, this I've only seen Tarte sell this in that kit. I wish they would come out with some more shades like this. I really, really love this formula. It is hydrating, but it's matte, which is nice. Uh, it does transfer some. It does not dry down. From, so, I mean, it's fine. I absolutely love this formula, so I don't even care about that. It's called their Lip Architect, and it is in the shade... What shade is this? Delightful, which it is wonderfully delightful. And this is how I actually store it. I just keep it next to, like, in the same little pot as my MAC um, lipstick. So that's why I wanted to wait on it. Um, so the next ones I'm going to do is... I'll do the other Kat Von D's that I have. This one is one that I do like and I have used quite a few times. I enjoy it. I just don't like how Matt, uh, sorry, Kat Von D's uh, lipsticks dry out your, my lips so badly. But I do enjoy that lipstick, so I'm going to go ahead and keep it. And then this one I enjoy as well, so I'm going to keep that one. And uh, this lip gloss by MAC, definitely keeping this. This is my 
only lip gloss. No, I have one other one. Uh, but it's my favorite lip gloss. It's just like an iridescent um, shine. And it's like a green and pink, or golden pink uh, iridescent. And it's called, what's it called? Gal Friday. So, yeah, I'm going to keep that. And then this is by Urban Decay. It's a deluxe size. It came in a kit with like two other ones. But I just have kept this one and decluttered the other one a while back. It is a tinted lip gloss and I really enjoy it. Okay, so I just washed off my hand. This one is by Kate. And I'm pretty sure this was like Katy Perry. I don't remember. But it's a lip balm. This is my second one I've had, I think. I really enjoy it. I like it. Uh, it's really hydrating. And it's just a cute little case, too. It's by Rimmel. Uh, the next one is this Rainforest of the Sea one. I really like that shade, but I never seem to use this one. And it doesn't... I don't know what the shade name is. It doesn't have the tag on it anymore. It's like a deluxe sample size. Uh, but I never use it, so I'm going to go ahead and get rid of it pass it on. Uh, the next one is a Beach Bum by Tarte and I love this lipstick so much. It's actually really close to that other shade but um, I love this lipstick so much. I'm gonna go ahead and keep this and then uh, the next one is this is called Birthday Sue. Oh this is the one that you get with the birthday gift from Sephora. Um, it's just too pinky. I just don't like those kind of pinky shades, so I'm going to go ahead and declutter that as well. Uh, the next one is this Lipstick Queen. I just wanted to try it out. It's like a deluxe size of it, or uh, travel size, I guess, because I did buy it. I don't know. But yeah, so it's the one where you put it on, and then it starts to turn like a reddish shade. And um, it's more of like a lip balm. It's decent. I like it. I just use it like a lip balm, basically. And I want a little bit of natural color. Uh, the next one is by Too Faced and it's called Nude Beach. <laughs> uh, so there it is right there. It's a little too pinky. It's more pink than what I like. Uh, but I do want to keep at least one because every once in a while I just feel like wearing a pinky shade. So I am going to go ahead and keep this one. Am I going to keep this one? Uh, no, actually, you know what? I'm going to trade it out with, oh no, yeah, because I want to make sure I keep at least one pinky one. So let's see here. Um. Okay, so from these three, uh, I'm going to go ahead and trade it out with, uh, this chocolate milkshake. I'm going to keep chocolate milkshake. And actually, oh my gosh, why am I doing this? I'm going to go ahead and keep nude too, but I am getting rid of that Too Faced one. Um, they're just, I can't. They are literally like the same shade. Oh my gosh, I'm ridiculous. Anyways, uh, <laughs> moving on. Uh, so this is my Revlon. This is the only, I think drugstore shade that I have so I am going to be keeping this just because you know I want to be able to do a drugstore face a uh, full face of drugstore uh, makeup uh, so then this one is by Tarte and this is like one of their chubby stick crayon thingies and this is undressed I love this shade not getting rid of this uh, this one is pure really enjoy this shade as well uh, there it is right there Gorgeous shades, gonna keep those. Um, and just trying to organize as I say I'm keeping them. And then this one is by Lime Crime. I love this shade, going to keep that. And I am so OCD sometimes, I have to line up the unicorn on these. <laughs> um, and then this one is also by Lime Crime. I'm trying to find like a place to swatch. There we go. You know, that is a little too red for me. Like that is just, I'm not going to use that. So I'm going to get rid of that too. Which makes me sad because it has a unicorn on it. But I'm keeping one of the unicorns so it makes me feel better, I guess. 
Yeah, it does. <laughs> uh, and then this is by Kat Von D. It is in the shade Cathedral. I really like this shade. I'm trying to find a place to swatch. There we go. I really like this shade. I am going to keep this as well. So this is what it looks like now. This is where I store my uh, lipsticks and uh, lip balms. Uh, and let me show you what I am decluttering. So I am going to be decluttering these. Well, it's a fairly decent amount of products. I'm I'm okay with that. I'm not mad at that. I'm 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 decently proud of myself, I suppose. Um, <laughs> so uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. And if you have any questions, please leave a comment below. Have a great day, and I hope you guys have a wonderful time. Until we meet again, bye.